Right for over there. Not <laughs> looking. Right forward, one day he wants to do look, don't mind. Do you think Wilder will win in a rematch with Fury? <clears throat> if I train him, if I train him, I can teach him how to win. I wanted random blood in your intestine for myself as well as my opponent. So at that particular time, when we was going to fight, I could have made somewhere upwards of 100 men in the beginning, but I had patience. Then eventually we got on the same terms, and then I, I turned a hundred million dollar fight into a three hundred million dollar fight. So, like I said before, I, I'm the smart businessman once again. Huh. I think, I think that. Um, Did anybody used to watch Charlie's Angels? Nobody knew what Charlie looked like. You just heard his voice on the phone. That's how Haley. Nobody knows what it looks like unless you're in that circle of trust. And now Haley is a shape. He's a new movement in our sports, but. Why he's so successful in what he's done. He managed to, 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 to do things with him. And then that there's not many people that have managed to get with him. Well, this is how the relationship starts. Because a lot of times when people see uh, a certain guy getting a ring, they think that guy is Alan. That's Sam Watson. There's a difference, there's a difference between Sam Watson and Alan. Sam Watson is Alan's best friend. And um, I can remember years ago, I would be in my Ferrari in LA, and I would be going to the basketball games, and a guy would come to me and say, You need to get the LA. Man, man, man. Man, man, that's powerful. You, 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 you. What's up, y'all, man? I'm back. It's been a cool little weekend, man. Back at the first job, you know, a little day job I got. But man, Floyd, hey, he. Doug said if Beyonce Wilder trained with him, he might be able to beat Fl uh, Furry. Tyson Furry. Tyson Fury, my bad. So, what y'all, man. That was a bold statement. Floyd's at some conference, you know, talking and stuff, and he said if uh, Wilder worked with him, I mean, Floyd do got the best defense in the game, in history. Floyd got the best defense in history. So he can he can help Wilder not get, take as many punches and keep his, you know, keep his legs and his uh, shit ready. And, and Floyd got some counters. Floyd can counter. I think, I think Wilder should take this advice and take help. Floyd didn't get to clown it after um, after Wilder lost. He just said, "Man, we still gotta keep pushing Wilder, man. We can't, we can't, you know, give up on him. We can't." But I ain't gonna lie. I, I'm, I might bet on Wilder because he I, he's for sure gonna be the underdog. He's gonna be the underdog in this next fight in Vegas, man. Psh, that that might be a huge payout. So I might bet on Wilder, man. Uh, Tyson Fury, um, man, he really ain't got nothing to lose. He ain't got, he got a lot to lose, but he gonna fight like he got a lot to lose. But he don't have as much as Wilder. If Wilder gets beat, especially beat bad this fight, they gonna look at him, they gonna look at him mad different. They gonna look at him mad different. So I hope Wilder, man, avenges this loss, man. Because boxing ain't, it ain't really shit, man. Wilder went down, man. Heavyweight boxing, man, it ain't shit no more. This is Wilder that went down. Now, Wilder would have won, it would have been still on the up and up. It would have had a Joshua fight speculation, and that could have been a, you know, hella bread. Fury versus Joshua ain't going to get, like, that mad bread like Wilder and Joshua would have got. But we going to see, though. We going we gonna, to we gonna see. And, hey, man. Tyson Fury, you got to give him his just dudes. He did his numbers. He was, he was in the ring training. Wilder was on that Instagram. Wilder was trying to look good for the people, man. Trying to look good for the people. But, man, that's all I got to say about this issue, though. I'm going. Please.